Hi friends, in this video, I'm going to talk about how to use grouping by API in Java 8 streams. For example, there are a lot of people from different countries and I would like to group them by their country. For example, I want to create a group who are coming from USA and I want to create another group who are coming from India and different countries. So how can I do that using grouping by API? Let's see the code now. I've created a class called group by demo and then there is a main method and inside the main method I'm creating a group of people so here you can see I'm creating group of people with their name and their country and their profession so there is a class called person I'm using lambok so that I can get the getters and setters automatically so name country and profession and I'm using country as an enum and profession as an enum so we have the list of people here now I want to create a map which contains country and a list of people who belong to this country. How can I do this in Java 8 streams API? So I call people.stream so that I can get people one by one and then I'm going to call collect API and inside that I'm going to call grouping by API. So the grouping by API takes the function as the parameter. When I say function, it is a functional interface. So please remember whenever we use functional interface, that means I can pass a lambda expression. So here we are passing a lambda expression. Here it is a method reference. So here I'm saying group this people list by their country. So here so it will be running a map by country and I'm going to print it in the console. So when I run this program, you can see on the left hand side we have the country and people who are coming from this country. So earlier we were using get country, you can use get profession. So any attribute you can group by. It is similar to SQL group by. So the next question is can I group by by multiple attributes or multiple field. So here you can see I'm going to do the group by by multiple fields. So group by country and then inside that group by profession. So it is possible to group by by multiple fields. So when you run this program, you can see first it grouped by the country and then by the profession. It is so powerful API, we can use it in our product. Hope this small example is helpful. All the best for your career. Please subscribe to interview.channel. See you in the next video. Thank you.